Hello and welcome to Friday Reads, where I tell you what I'm reading this weekend and review last week's pick. Last week, I was reading The Wangs vs. the World by Jade Chang, and I did finish it, and it was fantastic. So if you don't know anything about this book, it is about a family who lives in, well, a family who lives in California, and the father, Charles, who is one of the perspectives we read. He was a makeup mogul. He came over from Taiwan and he built this makeup empire, but then the recession of 2008 hit and he lost everything. And he has now decided that what he needs to do is first collect his family. He has three children. One is in a high school boarding school, one is in college, and another lives in New York and he decides that they need to all get back together and then they are going to China to reclaim the Wang family land. Charles grew up in Taiwan but considers China home and so he is very very committed to this idea and it is one of those books that has every sort of emotion in it so there are parts that are really exciting and happy and thrilling and then there are parts that are just really heavy and sad and some that make you angry and it just encompasses so much in this story of essentially a road trip. I loved the way that Jay Chang wrote the narrative and she bounces between the different members of the Wang family. So we see kind of the overarching narrative through the eyes of the five Wangs. There's three children, there's Charles, and then there is his wife, the children's stepmother, Barbara. And they each bring their own take onto what is happening, both financially and emotionally, and uh, this idea of what are we going to do next. And it's got just such a rich, a rich story. Uh, I also really love that Jay Chang brings the car into the narrative. Uh, the car has a couple of sections of its own where we kind of get to experience the feelings. Um, there is, you know, the car's thinking about who is sitting where and what they're doing to her, the, her being the car. So that just added this extra layer that I was skeptical if it would work, and then it worked really well. So I loved this, definitely, definitely enjoyed it. It is Jay Chang's first novel and it is really, really a fantastic novel to start with. So I'm really looking forward to other works when she gets around to publishing more books. I can't wait. So that is The Wangs vs. The World by Jay Chang. And now on to what I am reading this weekend. My Friday Reads this week is Misery by Stephen King. I am about halfway through it. So I am anticipating finishing it. I am obsessed with Stephen King. I love Stephen King. Um, I read pretty much anything by him, even if it's crappy, though I've only DNF'd one book and that was the Tommy Knockers and that was just awful. But Stephen King also admits that it was one of his worst books he's ever written. So I don't feel so bad about not finishing it, but I will tend to pick up anything by Stephen King. I grabbed this copy of Misery when I was in Austin over the holidays. There is the Austin Public Library's um, used bookstore and all paperbacks are a dollar and all hardbacks are two dollars and I always leave with lots of books and this is one of them. I had no idea what this book was about. It is apparently a movie, which I totally missed. Uh, but it is about an author named Paul, and he is in this awful car accident in Colorado. And uh, his biggest fan, Annie, saves him and then has kept him locked up in her house and is crazy. And I am, uh, like I said, halfway through, I'm getting to learn more about why and how Annie is just absolutely bonkers and I am just really enjoying it. It's Stephen King. It's fun. I can't wait to finish this and then watch the movie. Apparently the movie's really great so 
That's my Friday Reads is Misery by Stephen King. That's all I've got for this week's Friday Reads. You can check out all my past Friday Reads and all of our discussion videos, blog posts, all of that stuff is over at gameandread.com. You can also follow us on Twitter, Instagram, Litzy, and Facebook. We are at Game and Read, and you can listen to our podcast over at GameandRead.com or on iTunes, Stitcher, and various other podcasting hubs. You can listen to us. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next week. <laughs> <laughs>